the next topic is zero crossing detector so here zero crossing detector is nothing but it is an immediate application of the comparator is nothing but a zero crossing detector it is also known as sine wave to square square wave converter so it converts a sine wave into square wave here here the basic comparator can be used as zero crossing detector provided that v reference is set to zero means if i set the v reference to zero volts in the basic comparator i can use that basic comparator as a zero cross detector that's why it is called as immediate application of the comparator here how it works here the output v not is driven into negative saturation when the input signal v in passes through zero something but v not equals to minus v saturation when v passes through zero in the positive direction that i will show you in the waveforms so conversely v in passes through zero in the negative direction the output v not switches and saturates positively is nothing but v not equals to plus v saturation when v in passes through zero in the negative direction so that can be shown in the circuit diagram and the waveforms here so this is a circuit diagram here so in this circuit diagram here the input is connected to the inverting terminal hence it is called as inverting configuration of zero crossing detector here the reference voltage is connected to the connected to the positive terminal hence the reference voltage is, all, uh, is about 0 volts here okay so now so here again as per the explanation through the waveforms we are going to discuss how it works so here so when v in crosses the zero and moves towards the positive direction at that time v not should be minus v saturation similarly when v in crossing the zero and moves towards the negative so at that time v not should be plus v saturation here during positive cycle we are getting negative during negative cycle we are getting positive so this is because here we are using a inverting configuration as a comparator for zero crossing detector the name itself is zero crossing because when the input crosses the zero the output changes from positive to negative or negative to positive okay so this is one an immediate application of zero of a basic com comparator as a zero crossing detector okay so if you have any doubts you can text me a message thank you